I'm Greg, Greg Patterson, Deputy Chief Officer, CFA Training. Um, take care of the training portfolio for the state of Victoria for, for all CFA people and have accountability for training delivery uh, across the state. So organisationally we've had a real issue with electrical safety awareness training and low voltage fuse removal training for many, many years. And there's two advances in that area. The electrical safety awareness training, um, we can now actually deliver that in two ways. One is through face-to-face -face learning, using our structural instructors to, who are trained to deliver that now. Or indeed, we've just launched an e-learning package that is available on our learning management system. So that's available now, um, launched today, and that provides another opportunity for people to do that training. Low voltage fuse removal training, um, we've been working through a solution for that, and that solution is now here for us for 2018 and 2019 financial year. So one of the great things that I'm, I'm uh, looking forward to with our learning management system is the introduction of e-learning across a whole range of topics. And we have our intent is to pretty much put all our theoretical uh, learning that we currently do into e-learning packages available on, on the learning management system. The electrical safety awareness um, package is actually a prerequisite for low voltage fuse removal and it's actually going to take up one and a half hours of your time uh, actually doing the package online. If you were to go and do the training face to face, you're looking at three and a half hours minimum to complete that training face to face. So not only is there a saving in face to face training time if you choose to do it online, but you can do it at your leisure, at your own time, in your own premises or wherever suits you. Uh, we recognise our volunteers time it is precious and it probably provides just another opportunity for people to learn rather than the traditional face-to-face -face method. When we talk about low voltage fuse removal moving into this um, financial year, there's actually two ways that we're going to deliver this. The low voltage fuse removal is face-to-face -face training. The prerequisite training, electrical safety awareness, you can actually do in three ways. You can do it face-to-face -face with our structural instructors delivering it to your brigade or a group of people. Um, you can do it through the e-learning package, which is an online package available through our learning management system. Or one of the low voltage fuse removal courses will include the electrical safety awareness at the front end of the course. I make no apologies because we have to do that because not a lot of people will have the, the um, prerequisites and it will be a 10 hour day. It's an 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. course. If you've completed the electrical safety awareness as the prerequisite, the low voltage fuse removal training comes back to a six hour uh, day. So we bring people together for six hours. So the benefits of doing the prerequisite training um, before you go and do the low voltage fuse removal is that you can do it at home, um, you can do it online, and then it shortens up the training for the low voltage fuse removal. So one of the great advantages of any e-learning is that you can actually stop and start the e-learning dependent on your available time. You actually don't have to sit there for the one and a half hours to complete the electrical safety awareness training. You could do 30 minutes after dinner one night, stop there, kick into it the next day. It will take you back to where you finished off, do another half an hour. So you can actually spread it over a couple of nights. There's no requirement for people to sit down and do the whole one and a half hours in one, in one sitting. And that's an absolute advantage for e-learning. And that'll apply to all of our e-learning packages as well, not just electrical safety awareness. But this one's important because it is a prerequisite for low voltage fuse removal.